Genre. Expository text. Patterns of change. Rock solid. Solid as a rock is a saying often used to describe something that's reliable, that doesn't change. But in fact, rocks do change. The effects of water, wind, and temperature over long periods of time slowly transform one type of rock into another type of rock. These same forces also shape awe-inspiring landscapes and sketch designs on rock. Nature's patterns are visible in some rocks, as small as pebbles, and in wonders as vast as the Grand Canyon. The photograph across these pages shows one example of nature's art. This structure of rock, known as the wave formation, is made of sandstone. It is sand turned to rock over a long period of time. Igneous rocks. Igneous rocks are one type of rock. They are formed from hot, liquid rock called magma. Magma exists far below the Earth's surface, but it sometimes escapes to the surface through cracks, such as the mouths of volcanoes. Then we call it lava. This molten rock, or lava, is composed of minerals. As the minerals slowly cool, they form crystals. Eventually, the once fiery liquid hardens into a solid substance. There are many kinds of igneous rock. Their textures and colors come from their crystallized minerals. You may be familiar with granite, which feels rough and comes in many colors. Another variety of igneous rock is obsidian, which is smooth and often black. Granite, obsidian. Sedimentary rocks. Igneous rocks do not stay the same forever. Water and wind erode them, carrying away particles of broken rock and depositing them elsewhere. These particles may be left on a beach or riverbank, in a desert or the sea. Gradually, the particles collect in layers. The contact between the particles and the weight of the layers squeeze out any pockets of moisture or air. Pressed together, the particles form a new material called sedimentary rock. It is formed from many different sorts of sediment. It can include rocks and sand, as well as biological matter, such as plants, bones, and shells. Just as there are different kinds of igneous rock, there are different kinds of sedimentary rock. Sandstone is formed from sand. Limestone is composed of bones and shells. Rock formations. Over time, a layer can be created entirely of one kind of sedimentary rock. Geologists who study rocks call a layer made of the same material and at about the same time a stratum. Another stratum of a different kind can be deposited on top of the first one. The plural for stratum is strata. Many strata of different kinds of rock can accumulate. Each one will press down on those that came before it. Scientists learn a lot by studying the chronology of layers. The oldest layer will be at the bottom the youngest at the top. These layers of sedimentary rock can create dazzling patterns. Each layer will have its own texture and colors. Moreover, water and wind will continue to do their work. Captions Limestone Marble Sandstone The Rock Cycle Still, rocks continue to change. There is a third type of rock below the Earth's surface, called metamorphic rock. These rocks are pressed down upon by the layers of rock above them. At the same time, they are heated by the magma beneath them. Eventually, the heat will cause some metamorphic rock to melt and become magma. As the magma slowly cools, it will turn back into igneous rock. The repetition of this process is called the rock cycle. The rock cycle is a pattern, a pattern of change that repeats and continues. It transforms liquid rock into a solid substance. It builds cliffs from sand and bones, and it returns rock to liquid form. The rock cycle, squeezing and cementing. Sedimentary rock, heat and squeezing. Metamorphic rock, melting. Magma or lava, cools and hardens. Igneous rock. Sediment. Green arrows show how all rocks are broken into bits once again.